Hey there, pretty mama. Hi. Maybe you want to eat this? That's yummy stuff. Now, I heard you had a surprise last night. Come over here so we can see you. Turn around. Turn around, mommy. Yeah. Okay. There. Yeah. Nom nom. Okay. I heard a, you had a surprise. You you had three surprises actually. And you had this one, and you had this one. And then you had this one. Oh my goodness. We have so many babies right now. But I just thought I'd take out these little guys to show you. See, she's in nursing with mommy. Now you nursing. And you, I, there's another one here. <laughs> he's making a lot of noise. What are you doing? Stay with the babies. Stay with the babies. Come on, let the babies nurse. And that, you can hear the troublemaker here, right? You can hear him. Okay, baby, stay with your mommy. And then here, here is another one of our babies. This is one of Polo babies. Polo's babies. Here, why don't you go say hi to them? And go eat a little snack. But this is just a very small portion. And they never go down, by the way. They never do. Very small portion of the babies that we have right now. I just love it when they're trying to nurse with their mommy. Yeah. And it's always amazing how when they have eight babies, they manage to raise them all. That's what's just like, oh my goodness, how do they do that? He's drinking, and there's another one right underneath. And then that one wants to drink too. And then you, you need to just go and eat and say hi. Come on. Let's go, go snack. You're very cute. I'm sorry. I want to pick one of them up so I can show you better. Okay, maybe this one. Maybe this little baby. And this baby's just like not even a day old. You know? And of course, we don't breed here. That is the last thing we do. But unfortunately, we are always, always have a nursery full, full of babies. We have so many babies right now, in fact, that they don't fit in the nursery. So we've had to make some other cages available. Oh, is that a little nosy sticking out? Is that another little snooky? Yeah. <laughs> Oh my gosh, you guys. And the bigger baby, she's about three weeks old now. So she's ready to go. I just love those little newborn babies. And look, they're just so fully formed. Can I pick you up? She says no. And I'm drinking. Don't, leave. Don't let me not drink. Here. Look at the color, it's a beautiful color. Um, you can also tell that they're very young by their by the back of their little legs. They don't have the muscle tone yet. So you can really tell. I can't tell how, how young they are, kind of looking at that at those back legs. They never want to be picked up. <laughs> and it's normal. They're always like little, I call them little, little jumpy, jumping beans and racing cars. Little zippy cars. Because they're so fast. Hi, precious. Welcome to the world. And then in three weeks, they're going to be as big as this one. 
which is crazy to think, right? Because they grow so fast. It's like mushrooms. They grow like mushrooms. So if you want a baby guinea pig, just remember, it's not gonna be very long till <laughs> they're looking like this. Because you're, I don't even know if you're three weeks old yet. You might not even be three weeks. No. And they were super, super, super cute. So all three babies are now hiding underneath mommy. Let's see what's happening on the other side. Yes, mommy's safety. And you are just a little confused. Like, what am I doing here? I kind of want to eat the kill, but then I kind of not. I kind of want to explore, but I'm a little scared. So I guess I'll just stay and have another piece of kill. Good girl. <laughs> Good girl. So this is just a beautiful Memorial Day weekend here at the ranch on a Sunday and it's all quiet and you know just thought I'd share this with you the preciousness of it all and this is much better than when I photo you know when I when I do it in the cage because you don't really get to know them so well and see them and and this one is definitely nursing Um, so this is much better, so you really get a better idea, we can see them close up without them running away, and then you can hear me better too, and I can talk a little bit. So yeah, okay, you there, let me grab you little baby, let me grab you, get you here for where are you gonna go straight underneath your mommy? Of course you are. Must be nice being guinea pig baby. You get your mommy and you can run on her mommy. Mommy takes such good care. Guinea pig baby mommies are always such good yeah, mommies. They are. And oh yeah, hey, you're being oh no, you you're being very adventurous. So this this age is too young to be eating hard food, but in a couple of days I wouldn't be surprised to see them eating parsley. And she's nuzzling to find the nipple. Oh wait, you are eating? That's great. You are eating your kale. Because sometimes there are exceptions that go like after, an hour after birth. We'll be eating food. Yeah. We'll be taking a nibble off of something. Just never know. You get some precocious baby. Well, isn't this a lovely scene, huh? I just thought I'd share that with you. This is... I took a little time for myself and spend a little time with the cuteness and I thought I'd share it all right guys there's more food inside yeah there's not just sparse um kale on offer tonight much more good stuff <laughs> okay okay well thank you for joining me for this lovely little moment guys Thank you.